Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all having a beautiful day. So very excited for today's video because I get to show you my favorite Ingwa products. I also have a sun card which I'm going to put here so for you guys to enjoy. And without further ado, let's get into the video. Firstly, I wanted to show you my favorite highlighters that they have. I was really tempted to put just a tiny bit of my nose, but I'll show you what I mean with my favorite highlighters. So they do have this one that it's called Glow On. This is how it looks. It's beautiful and I literally just like put it on my finger and I just pop it on my nose just then and that's how it looks. It's really nice and shiny. A little goes a long way so I'm just going to tap it there and you can see how much I'm going to have to blend it a little bit there we go don't worry I'll blend it um, and I'm going to pop it in the inner corner of my eyes my brow bone and all those pretty places it makes us glow Perfect. That's where we want them. And literally, I just put one drop on my finger, and this is all you need for your entire face. So, this is one of my favorites, and it's so small that you can actually pop it in your bag, and you know that you're going to be glowing for the rest of the day. Okay, sorry about that. My neighborhood got a little bit noisy. <laughs> so on to the next um, highlighter that I really, really love for them. This is the one. I'll show you. Body. This one you can also use as an eyeshadow or for your chest to highlight your collarbones. I really, really like this. So what I'm going to do, it comes with this one that I already been using. And you just tap. Tap in this one. You can go over it, keep highlighting, oh that's a bit much, highlighting, going over what we just did, you don't really need it because um, this one dries really nicely, it's not sticky the other one, if you want a little bit extra, if you want to use it as a nice shadow, it's a really really nice color, I like this one because it is a nice balance, because it's not too much and it's not not enough if that makes sense so really really like that one i highly recommend it i'll put all the links down below as well for you guys to have so now we're going to jump onto my favorite lipsticks okay guys so this is what you must have on your makeup kit i really really love this one so basically i have three colors here there you go so this one is the one that i use every day then the pink one I would wear basically for a night out, um, a date night or anything like that and you always need a red and this is a really nice red and when I was buying it the girl said to me that that is one of the best sellers. Uh, so for this one, the one that I use every day, this is how it looks, I'll put it over again so you can guys see. And I think that it makes my lips really, really nice and full. So this is one I use it. I use it every day. I get a million questions on Instagram. What lipsticks do I use? And it kind of gives me that look that I got my lips done because I overdraw them. Um, and it kind of like, because of the texture, I think that it looks really nice and plumped. Even though my lips are not the thickest. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to take this off and I'm going to... And try the other one so you can guys see how it looks all right so I just took it off and this is how my lips look uh, without the lipstick much smaller as you can guys notice by now but yeah this is how it looks without it so that's why I really like that one just saying so now I'm going to show you this one this one is a must-have to like a dinner or anything like that um, I really really like it it surprised me because it's quite dark for my tone, for my skin tone and I thought that you know it wasn't going to look good because I don't suit dark colors 
Uh, but yeah, I really, really like it and I highly, highly recommend it. So for that, I'm actually going to go with the um, lip liner. So this is the one that I'm going to use. It's a 316. And I'm going to overdraw. By the way, this one is the number 26 and the other one is the number... 17 so 26 is the one that I'm going to use now and 17 is the one that I used before So I always be going I'm obviously going to overdraw it Perfect. Now I'm gonna go over with this one, number 26. Perfect, and I'm going to overdraw it. And I'm going to paint it as overdraw it already did that. By the way, that was really hard to remove. Reason why? Because they last really long. So this is the other one and this is the look with the lip liner and obviously again and obviously making them look a little bit bigger. But yeah, I really like this. I when I got it, it really really surprised me because you know I don't suit dark colors, darker colors. And yeah, I think this one is a really, really nice color and I cannot wait to get out of lockdown so I can use it and I can go out and I can go out for dinner and glam and all that. So let me know in the comments below how you guys are doing. So now I'm going to remove this one and show you the super amazing red that it is. All right, so now I removed the other one and because when I removed it, I removed also my foundation I'm going to show you this one you know that I never change my foundation because I'm really happy with it but I got this one to try it out it's the HD perfect cover up so that's how it looks and this one is in number 76 um, spot on my color it's literally such a good match to my skin and I'm just gonna go and just fix that those parts that I just removed perfect perfect now that I got my naked lips again I'm going to go over with the lip liner this is the number 58 and obviously it's a red because we're going to paint with the red and also I'm going to go over my lips I can't do <laughs> I'm talking to this so I'll just be silent for a second so once that is done and I look a little bit funny I'm going to use the number 12 this is that perfect red that you need to have just like I did before I'm going to put the HD cover up to fix all my mess ups with the red lipsticks are really hard to get a perfect application in general so that's my foundation and oh that's really good there we go Perfect. Mm. 
and done that's like the perfect application with a little bit of help with the foundation as well okay so that is the final look i hope you like it let me know in the comments below which color is your favorite if you did like the highlighters i am definitely glowing i really like it inglot is a brand that i always look up to every time that i go and do a photo shoot all the makeup artists uh, always have like the Inglot kit and that just only speaks about how good the brand is so yeah i hope you really enjoy it let me know if you tried anything out i'll, I'll pop the discount code as well for you guys to have and yeah i hope you loved it thank you for watching big kisses stay safe and see ya